This weekend, SU will put its eight game win streak on the line against the number one team in the conference. After sweeping RIT last weekend, Syracuse pulled within one point of conference leader Mercyhurst. The Orange have never beaten the Lakers, but this year's team isn't worried about the past. We get so pumped up when we play Mercyhurst. You know, we know we know we have a really good chance at them. We know we know we just have to do everything well. If we play the last like we have the last eight games, we can come out with two W's that weekend, and that'll be great for us in the standings. Whatever happens this coming weekend, we're going to play hard. And they'll play. You know, they're going to be. We'll be competitive. We'll be ready. And I, I think we can't dwell on it. What's happened in the past has happened. We got to move forward. And we have a uh, huge momentum going into this weekend, and I think on the ice we were all sticking up for each other. So I think our teams just rallied together right now, and um, we're ready to go. Not only will this weekend feature an important series, but also an important cause. It's Syracuse's annual Skate for the Cure. The team has been selling t-shirts like these and ribbons to raise money for the Upstate Cancer Center. There will also be a raffle at both of the games. Syracuse faces off against Mercyhurst in the first game of the series here at home on Friday at 7. Reporting from Tennedy Ice Pavilion, Katie Williams, Citrus TV.